Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Trang and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a cash envelope stuffing and sinking fund stuffing for paycheck number two. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and grab my cash and also the cash envelopes. If you guys couldn't tell, we finally got internet. So I'm super excited about that and excited to finally get back on a schedule and post when I want instead of going to a coffee shop or a family's place to upload. I have my cash right here. Let's go ahead and organize this really quick. Hope everyone is doing good. All right, so we have our cash all set up. Here are my cash envelopes. Let's go ahead and get started. First up, I have car insurance. For car insurance, I think I remember stuffing an additional 20. Please ignore my nail. It's still broken and I still haven't fixed it. The weekly stuffing for car insurance is $45, but because I added 20 from the stimulus check, I'm going to add just $25 this time. So let's go ahead and write that in for 25. And now the balance is $90. Let's go ahead and grab 25. Car insurance is now all done. I might have to transfer this over to my bank envelope and then deposit into the bank because my car insurance is on auto pay and it'll take the money from my account. So I need to go ahead and go deposit this before it does that. So yeah, car insurance is now all done. Next up, I have internet. We finally got that all situated. I think I waited for about three weeks. Um, originally, we went with AT&T, but they actually didn't send someone out, even though we scheduled it. So we waited three weeks for nothing. So I went ahead and changed it to a Spectrum, and they actually came out super fast. All right, let's add in another $28 and get this to 56. The bill is actually $55 and some change, I believe. So we're going to go ahead and round up to 56. So let's grab 20, 5, 1, 2, 3. So now we have a balance of $56 for internet. All right, internet is now all done. Next up, we have trash. Our trash, I believe it's paid three months in advance and it's $90 for the three months. So I broke it down to $30 a month. So each paycheck, we are putting away $15. So let's grab another 15 and get our balance to 30. All right, so this month is all taken care of. All right, trash is now all done. Next up, I have my baby, Haley. 
Bailey gets her usual $50. So this brings her total to $150. Grab 50. Oh yay, actually, I'm gonna switch this one. This one's cuter. I can't wait to see it all grow, especially for my daughter. All right, Haley is not all done. Next up, I have Christmas. For Christmas, I believe it's $35. I put in an extra $35 from the stimulus. Put in another $35, and that totals it to $105. Let's grab $20. Let's see if Are you guys more of a receiver or a giver? With Christmas, I mean. <laughs> I personally like to give. I think receiving can be very awkward and I don't like the attention um, that everyone gives you when you're when everyone is watching you open your present. So definitely not for me. <laughs> definitely more of a giver. All right, Christmas is not all done. Next up, I have holidays. Holidays, let's put in another $7. Brings our total to $19. Still have to figure out what to get my fiance for Father's Day, so I have some time to do that. If you guys have any ideas, please let me know. All right, holidays is now all done. Next up, I have Haley's birthday. She gets another $50. I think I put in 70 last time, yep. Okay, let's put in $50. Her birthday is coming up. I say soon, but I have a couple months. But I'd rather be prepared than not. So let's go ahead and put in another 50. She has a total of $170. Haley's birthday is now all done. Next up, I have Bubs. For Bubs, we are putting away another $10. So he has a total of is now all done. Next up, I have Amazon Prime. For Amazon Prime, I'm putting away $7. That brings the total up to $14. Oops, too much. All right. $14. Sometimes I wonder what we did before Amazon Prime because <laughs> even with Amazon Prime, don't you get impatient waiting for your package? I sometimes start tracking my package right after I order, which is a really bad habit because I'm pretty sure there is no update. But yeah, sometimes I wonder what we actually did before Amazon Prime because this is genius. So Amazon Prime is now all done. Next up, I have birthdays. For birthdays, it's getting another $20. Brings our total up to 
brings a total up to sixty dollars. I think the next birthday we have is my sister-in-law. And then mother-in-law. Alright, birthdays is now all done. Next up I have gifts. Gifts is just getting another $5. Brings it to $15. All right, gifts is now all done. Next up, I have beauty. For beauty, currently have $10. I'm adding in, in another $5 to give it $15. Okay, beauty is now all done. Next up, I have miscellaneous. Miscellaneous currently has five dollars. So if you guys can hear the water. That's just my mother-in-law She's like washing the dishes right now and even though we're a couple rooms away um, You might still hear it. Sorry about that All right, so now we have a total of ten dollars for miscellaneous All right, miscellaneous is now all done. And then I also have my two mini cash envelopes of gas and food. For food, I still haven't spent anything yet, which is very odd, but my fiance uses my car to go to work because we haven't towed his car to our location. So yeah, when he goes to work, we don't really go anywhere. And I guess that saves money on gas and also food because I'm not roaming out by myself and then getting food. So that's why I still have a lot left over. So for food, I'm going to add in another $10. Uh, pretty sure I'll use it next week or whenever he's off. All right, food is not all done. Next up, I have gas. For gas, my mother-in-law actually just paid for his gas, so <laughs> I'm still going to put in another $25. It was actually $51 for gas, pretty much really close. So at least we have gas ready for next week or whenever he needs it. Alright, gas is now all done. Last but not least, I have the bank cash envelope. I also mentioned earlier that I need to transfer some of the cash over to the bank. Just reorganize this really quick. So we should have 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 130, 140, 141, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. And that's... All correct and this is going straight to the bank all right now the bank envelope is all done all my cash envelopes are done let's go ahead and put this back into my planner I'm gonna put these two into my wallet. See if it fits still, even though it's pretty stuffed, it should still fit. Okay, perfect. Even though the envelope was pretty thick and stuffed, 
it still fits my wallet which is perfect all right guys so that basically wraps up this video thank you guys so much for watching if you guys made it this far i just want I just wanted to let you guys know that I am doing a small giveaway as a token of my appreciation for all of the support that you guys have been giving me. I will be choosing one winner for this giveaway and the winner can choose from a $20 Amazon gift card or I can make up to 10 cash envelopes your choice if you want to do vertical, horizontal, or both. If you guys want to enter this giveaway, make sure you guys are First, subscribe to my channel. Second, like this video. And third, just leave a comment down below and let me know how you guys are doing. So that basically concludes this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye. I won't make it easy for you now. Too many times